Hello, my name is Nelly and welcome back to another video. Today, I want to help people with a common problem um, that they might see on Coinly, which is access denied on auto sync wallets. So it's going to be a short video where I walk through our Coinly help center guide. And um, if you have any questions, as always, you can leave them down below. Um, but yeah, let's jump into it. Okay, so jumping into it, um, the issue at hand, it looks something like this. This is a example since I don't have this issue in my actual wallet, but this is what it looks like. So for the Kraken wallet, you see a access denied, check your API keys or try reconnecting um, the wallet. So if you are seeing the access denied error on the wallets page for any of your wallets, then usually it means your API keys are incorrect, missing. Uh, or missing the right permissions or they have expired so make sure to check all of these I've talked about this um, in you know in a lot more in like the Binance video for example which for Binance it doesn't have the best APIs and, and it has a lot of issues with its API so make sure that the API keys that you copied are correct make sure that there's no missing permissions on the website you are getting the API keys from and then lastly make sure they haven't expired so you can click on the wallet then go on api settings which will open up a pop-up box similar to the one below so i'll show you a screenshot of that so access denied e a e a p i invalid so there's a key this is just a generic um number this isn't actually a key um but anyways go back look at the error message shown in the box this error is the one that coinly is getting from your ex uh, your exchange api it can usually tell you in more detail what the problem is, etc. Like we talked about earlier, missing permissions, expired credentials. Some websites have a very short limit on you know how long their API lasts, so make sure to look into that. Once you have the problem figured out, once you've changed your API keys or you know updated them, click the save changes, and this will prompt a um, resync for your wallet, or you can also manually do it. So you find the wallet, click on the three dots and click uh, click sync, sync wallet but yeah pretty straightforward i don't think this was a complicated video but i know some people might have this issue so we thought we'd make a video on it um if you enjoyed the video consider dropping a like subscribing for more crypto content and i'll see you next time peace